How's it going, everybody? I'm bringing you here back with another video on Final Fantasy 16. Hope you guys are excited. So I came back to the uh, to Clive the hideaway, and uh, we did I uh, did a couple of side quests, literally two. I upgraded my my broadsword to a long sword, and then some of my equipment. Let's get into this thing, huh? So much for arriving before sunset. Oh, I didn't realize we were this close. Any idea what that is they built the village around? The fallen ruin. I've heard some call it an airship. Though its flying days seem to be behind it. It's a shame, that. You truly think a dominance waiting for us in that village? My scout has never given me any reason to doubt him. Which is why I think we should hurry. Come on. Airships? You guys don't know airships. Airships are very common in fun effects. Except for this game, apparently. Attuning with an obelisk, Clive, to travel quickly to location via both world map and local map. Alright, I apologize if I'm still like, gonna wake up. This isn't the first time I've seen one of these. Perhaps I can use them as way marks. Yeah. Oh, that way now. Oh, oh, see? Okay. Big as arena, basically. <laughs> Man's got some speed to him. Look at him. I think not. I that this animation is freaking go faster. I know I'm walking around for no reason. Figures up ahead. But are they friends or foes? Look like foe. You! I brought on another skin! That's enough! Oh. to ask the next ones we meet. Let me know how it goes. All right, hold on, yo. All right. <laughs> okay, so let's tell you what I did. I did was... Hmm. 
what it did was I, so I have the the PS5 Pro. What it did was I added the uh, the back buttons for triangle. Instead of me having to hold it up there and then make it all awkward, so I can't even press the uh, yeah! press the button for. So like during combat, I have the the button in the back. Useful. Very useful. No sign of the royalists. Or anyone else for that matter. It's too bloody quiet. Even for this hour. What do we do now? First we look for my scouts. You start here, I'll circle around the back. How do I let you know if I find him? Good question. Shout. <laughs> Subtle. My man, Sadolphus. I, just I don't even know. know what he looks like. Anything up here? Not that I see now. Right. The village can't be completely abandoned, can it? But yeah. I don't even know if I should be exploring right now. It was just Damn a it. wall. No one here. I know, dog. Here she lied. <laughs> oh, wait. Is that Murdoch? This man's gonna die if we don't get into a healer. Enough of your barking, dog! About time. Dog, is that Murdoch? Stand back. <laughs> he really did shout. Thought you Bro. weren't coming. You still alive, Gav? Yeah. <laughs> Barely. Been doing what I can for the villagers, but... I thought you were joking. It's all right. He's with me. Is this everyone? That's not Murdoch. No. There were others. 
A pair of royalists came for the bearers just before you arrived. Was a dominant among them? Maybe. It's not like he was holding a sign. We'll give you one guess where he's going. Clive, after him. Where you going, bitch? Come back. I'm about to rain fire on your ass. You're just fast, dog. Clive, step it up, bro. <laughs> Any word from the scouts? <laughs> Not yet, my lady. But we have the dominant's companion. It's only a matter of time before we seize our quarry. Very good. And what of the others? The bearers have been taken to Care Norvent. Some may still be worth keeping, should the Dominant elude us. All is in hand, my lady. They will not be spoiled. I give you my word. <laughs> Gentlemen, a toast! Will you join me? <laughs> my thanks. To our Lady of the Wind. And the King! <laughs> Imperials drink this piss? Well, it would go some way to explain their breath. <laughs> <laughs> Lady Benedicta! Imperials! We will fight now. Duke's up. And instead of killing them, you lead the rats straight to us. Mercy! <laughs> Look what we have here, boys. An Imperial Bearer. Good. I was getting bored. You ready, bitch? You, you think you're special? Oh! <laughs>
Thought I had her with that last use. Eric Smith. Fire right what? You've got some fight in you, even for a branded. <laughs> Clive! <laughs> Look who's here to save the day. Is this how you recruit all of your charges? Hold on, this is... Wait, I know who she is. Alright, Commander of the King. Yeah, we've... we've yeah. See the faithful scout who puts the legendary notes to the work and tracking in labors of interest to hide away. Ever agreeable fellow only and enemy lines if you can. Um, sediment during the edge of the great wood, having initially found prosperity as a stopover point for traveling traders, it fell. Favor one newer, better roads by passing them actually fell off the map entirely. Both and not. And around fallen ruins and people have lost and claimed this one's called an area. Elite unit of royal knights of Walud led by Benedicta Harmon. Led clandestine incursions deep into the territory of enemies nations for myriad purposes. Espionage and such. Um, we, we know about this. Don't recall you complaining, Benedicta. So, Sidolphus, remind me, why was it that you betrayed your kingdom? Oh, damn. I asked you a question, Lord Commander. Lord Commander? Why? Because I'd had enough of you and your king's antics. And yet here you are, stealing my branded. What are you plotting? As if I'd tell you. Lady Benedicta, we have secured the dominant. Holy oh, son. And she's gone. And so dominant. Did she say where she was going? No. Then we head back to Lost Wing. One of the villagers may have heard something. Hopefully, but we can't just... Which is why I sent Gav. <laughs> the man has a nose for these things. Trust me. And I, we just read that legendary <sighs> nose. Like a bloodhound. Human blood hand. To be honest, I'm really loving this game. Glory and all. There's too much. So, it wasn't about bears at all. They were looking for a dominant. Yeah, that's right. I thought we were hiding the bastard. <laughs> Can any of us would keep a monster like that under our roof? No offense. When no one talked, they started rounding up everyone with a brain. And then everyone without one and all. And locked you in the cellar, hoping sooner or later someone would break. Yeah. There's a little girl. <laughs> you know, things might have been different if you'd accepted my invitation. Oh, don't remind us. We were all saying the same thing. This is our own, isn't it? Don't mean we won't help when we can, though. And that, I'll drink to. Oh, come hear the tale of Spoody your on the boat. Oh, they even gave the dark song. A thousand unslain, the tenfold. One hundred full legions the young dragoon led. 
Listen, Clive. Revenge won't bring him back. It won't. Thirteen years ago, I watched a dominant kill my brother right you in front of me. You were the dominant, me. bro. And I did nothing. But now I can. I can kill the son of a bitch and bring peace to my brother's soul. He doesn't understand. After that, whatever happens, happens. Fate. You're content to be a slave then. Yeah, so be it. Yeah. This music, son. His radiance would have us believe the Imperial host invincible. Yet here we find the Empire's cornerstone teetering on the backs of a handful of cowards and cutthroats. <laughs> While Bahamut may lead a hundred full legions, could it be that the young prince defends a house of cards ready to topple at the slightest breeze? Tell me something. Why do you not resist? Within you lies the power to slay gods. The phoenix perished in your flames. Yet you do not fight. You do not flee. You refuse your gift. No, can't be him. Perhaps you are distracted. <sighs> Who's this? Do you guys see the dominant of fire? M mysterious figure who was first seen amid the chaos of the Imperial invasion of Phoenix Gate immediately before the. <gasps> Here's the second icon of fire, that very icon of that slew the heir of the throne. Clyde believes this man to be the dominant who murdered his brother. Uh, retaining the device. Oh! Very dominant that you actually range active. Charge of crystals of the ether, their flesh, thus preventing them from priming or casting magnets. So valuable are the materials from which they are made. So where is right to craft them? But when absolutely necessary. An imperial stronghold located in the northern <clears throat> fringes of San Bros. San territory. Far from the capital of Or Flame, it occupies a key strategic adjacent to the crystal. Belt and it's suitable, portable, formidably fortified as a result. Within walls, there's a quarters of church, a gal, ancient warehouses. Who are you? I don't know who that is. Who is it? My offer still stands. Join us, and you will be treated with the respect who one of is that person. Doesn't say kind deserves. <laughs> Lord Margrace, don't! I'll give you a moment to consider your options. Do be gentle with them. Falling asleep, Clive. <laughs> Wake up, Gav's back. Canovent, one of the Empire's outlying strongholds. 
Though apparently not strong enough to keep out the Royalists. The captured bearers are inside. I'm sure of it. If Benedict's orders are to out. stay in the shadows, she won't be travelling with many men. Meaning, she'll be keeping her prisoners together and close by. Including the Dominant. So, we find a way into the fortress and conjure a bit of chaos. Uh, what about me? Excellent question, Gav. You will wait outside the care and guide those I free to safety. And miss all the fun? Why can't he do that? <laughs> Clive doesn't have your nose. He'd stumble off a cliff before he even found the men. Come on, Gav. You're the best man for the job. Well, <laughs> let me put it that way. Was I better scout ahead for any surprises? Don't you let him down. I won't. All right. Shall we? Not so fast. We wait until tomorrow. But he, he's right there. And if we leave now, we'll arrive just as the sun comes up. Maybe join the guards in breaking their fast. Come on, Clive. They only just took the place. They'll be there a while yet. <clears throat> We've got one chance at this. You don't want to waste it, do you? No. All right, you don't. Damn. Damn. All right, Von Torgo, let's go check this place out. Actually, maybe, I think we got some ability points now. And then bad boys. Ooh. The story begins. New weapons, new items will come available at the hideaways training post as forge recipes. No, that's settled. There's someone I want you to meet. Uh, no, at no. this hour. Abilities. 17. Ain't nothing. Okay. <clears throat> Good one. These all <clears throat> excuse me to dodge at the moment. I can master that. We're gonna learn this lunch. And we're gonna No no no, I don't want this one. Here. So now it's hold off on the rest. He's the owner of the tavern. Best hope of getting a decent night's nice kit. Hello, merchant, sir. Any friend of the innkeeper is a friend of mine. I have. I do. Yeah, my longsword is better. I hope it's to your liking. I'm buying these because I trust it's all here. Most likely, they're going to be better than what I have. Meteorite. Oh. Uh, right, so it is a thousand. Jesus. Uh, idols of the Imperial Empire Orchest Orchestrian Role Songs. So. Valuable. So. Yeah, traded for. Valuable can be traded for guilt. Yes. Here's what we agreed on. We never have too many. Then that's it. You're always welcome here in Lost Wing. Get your fam. There is no merchant. Those are the Quentin, my good man. It seems we'll be spending the night. I thought as much. Where do you find that one? What, oh, him? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. <clears throat> Quinton here is an old friend, one who is sympathetic to our cause. Sympathetic? Then he knows about your little sanctuary. I would never have guessed so many people were bent on setting us free. Hmm. When last I checked, 
The mere thought would earn you a trip to the gallows. I am well aware of the risks, as I am of the rewards. And what could be more rewarding than your very own dominant of fire? A dominant? Here? Now that I would like to see. <sighs> Meaning you haven't. No, but nothing passes unnoticed in Lost Wing. Take your brand, for example. Hmm. People will see that at once. And I need hardly tell you how they will greet the inquiries of a bearer. You are afraid your words will fall on deaf ears, as they have ever since the moment you were marked. Here. How do you know that? Happily, I can provide a solution to your dilemma. As a favor to Sid, that is. Move the mark. Take this. You will find it has the uncanny power to loosen tongues. See you. <clears throat> Except the hangman. May the mothers guide you. Oh, you're not gonna move the mark? Is that brand gonna stay there? This might be Imperial land, but here in Lost Wing, it's his word that's law. But how? You don't need to worry about that just yet. Trust me. Everyone in Lost Wing knows what that seal means. And what it means if they don't take note. Mm. Now we can sit here counting our blessings, or put them to good use and find our dominance. Your choice. Find a dominant, bro. Kill him. Let's see if this thing really works. Master Quinton has asked that we work through the night to undo the chaos the Royalists wreaked. But I fear dawn will have long since broken before the true damage is mended. Mm. Yes, yes. Mind your step. The Royalists didn't do as the courtesy of tidying up when they left. Oi, how about some light over here? Some <sighs> what a mess. The king believed one Hello, woodcutter. Ah, Master Quinton took a liking to you, I see. And there I was, thinking you were in bed with Sid. Wonder what Gav will have to say about this. Speaking of whom, if you see him, tell him thanks for looking after us. Now, what can I help you with? I'm searching for a dominant Why you say like that? Gav seems to think he might have taken refuge here. We see a lot of bearers around these parts. But I do seem to recall one who commanded the flame. Now, whether or not that makes him a dominant, I can't say. But the Waludas certainly took a keen interest in the poor sod. Did you go look at him? Didn't have a chance. One of the other bearers might have died. Thank you. Did it, Ben? That's all you can remember. Think hard. Damn, this place is huge. Excuse me, miss. That a hanged man, I see. Master Quentin must think you're important. Must think? It was a good thing you done today, getting rid of those bastards. If you hadn't come when you did, I'd be on my way to Ash by now. Along with the others. Poor buggers. These others. Was there a dominant among them? A dominant of fire? Might have been, yeah. Royalists seem to think there was, anyhow. A thin bloke all swallowed up in his robes like one of great Grieger's churchmen. Do you recall anything else about him? Only that you weren't alone. Was a young maid who went wherever he did, including the church. 
And wherever the royalists dragged them both off to before you got here. I see. Thank you. I wonder if Sid's found anything. A bow. Bloody cowards! Setting upon us off the Anything over here? Gotta be something. Damn thing, Torgo. Yeah. All right. You sit. You're fine, bro. Tell me that scowl means you've got good news. That'd be good. So, a shady lad with a hood and his equally shady lass. Not much to go on, but. But. I've been thinking if our friend is a dominant, why not just burn the royalist to a crisp? True. There's a reason he's holding back, and I reckon he has something to do with his partner. What makes you say that? One of the villagers I talked to. Said the two were separated. If the Waluders have her, our dominance like to think twice before starting any fires. True. Whoever he is, he's shown himself to have a level head. He's careful, cunning, and he doesn't want to be found. This could spell trouble. For us and the Royalists both. <sighs> Still, it'll be a whole lot worse if we set off after them with bleary eyes and empty bellies. There should be a pair of pallets waiting for us back at the inn. Shall we? Grab some food real fast. All right, all right, come on. Hey, Quinton, get up, man. Now, beds. I seem to recall your request being to spend the night. And for that, the floor will more than suffice. <laughs> Better than a wet rock, I suppose. <sighs> My thanks, Quinton. Next time you're at the hideaway, our floor's all yours. <laughs> no need for thanks, Sid. This isn't an act of charity. You don't say. In exchange for my floor, I shall be requiring your services. The Royalists saw fit to erect a barricade across the road south when they occupied the village, and failed to remove it when they left. I expect it to be gone before you leave. As you wish. Life, take care of that, will you? E. The following you. Well, that took longer than expected. First time dismantling the barricade? It gets easier, don't worry. I won't. If we leave now, we'll arrive at the care when the shadows are at the deepest. Well, I should rather wait. No more waiting. If it just wants to go. The road south then. Unless. I know of another shortcut. You should be so lucky. Wait. Oh, this is the right way. Hello? Bye. Oh, this is the same way uh, I was chasing that guy. Huh. Bro, you me the wrong way. Now speed up, go! The music's so chill, relaxing. <laughs> Hold on. Don't tell me I went the wrong way, dog.
it above us? It is above us. Crap, man. Actually, I know it's a skip. Road here cuts through Lorbert's Pass to Care Northern. You're not thinking of heading that way, are you? Yeah. If the Royalists were looking to take the care that had posted centuries to prevent any unwelcome surprises, at least I would have. Well, you should know. <sighs> there it is. Speed boost. Majesty's cunning stunts, and he sent his best to execute it. Hmm, what's over here? Why oh, it looks so suspicious? Like, oh, there's some stuff over there. But find out what it is. Oh. There's really nothing here, bro. have to get better at cutting the dog. Oh, we press this mission nearby. Huh? 
Much as I enjoy battering down the front door, I hazard this endeavor will require a bit more tact. There's an old sluice that empties under the bridge. It should see us through to the lower levels of the care. Sid. G. Lie. We both know why I'm here. But what is it that you want? Why would you risk your life for a handful of outcasts? If anyone ever learned what you've been doing with their property... They have my head in a box. But this isn't just about dominance and bearers, it's about all of us. What I want is to build a place where it doesn't matter what you are, but who you are. But our world isn't ready for a place like that. Damn. All right. So, until it is, I use the power I've been given to show people there is hope. Oh, he saw him. You know he saw him. Yeah, that's like pitch black out there. You can't see. Him. So, tell me about this Benedicta. The best and worst decision I ever made. <laughs> Don't underestimate her, Clive. A fight with her icon is not one you're likely to walk away from. Garuda. Warden of the Wind. Hey. Mm -hmm. There's one reason I like Sid, though. And I think it's because he's like stupid calm. That dude is like chill as hell. Is there any quest nearby? Sure, let me know. All oh, readable quests. Let's get this party started. Oh. Thalan has fallen. The eastern territories all but belong to the orcs. I'll have my men ready to depart by noon. No bother. But what of the mines? Without adamantite... The blight would have engulfed the mines ere long. Besides, you already have your orders. Yes, my liege. Mr. King? The dark swallows more of the realm with each passing day. The land starved of the ether that gives it life. And as the fringes fade, the people flock to the mother crystals, desperate for their blessing. The war we wage for possession of that blessing, it breaks us from within, hastening us to our own destruction. And so you do what must be done. I unite the dominance, that we may bring an end to the strife, and found a new order to see us unto tomorrow. The, hell? the world must be restored, and I will see it so. You might have already had Sidolphus not betrayed us. Him again. Lust you still for his embrace? But... of course not. My liege, I serve you, and you alone. Ah. I remember well the day you first entered these halls. <laughs> Your pale hand pressed into his, as if he would never let go. That... that was a long time ago. Yours... Is the only hand I need. Now and always. 
soon, my dear. Soon all will know whose hand it is that keeps them from falling into the darkness. Hold me, my leash. Never let me go. One of our sentries has failed to report, my lady. Your orders? Pull the men back inside the care, Geralt. He is here, then. Have them lead Sid and his little pet to the chapel. She I shall entertain knew. them there. She, she, like... I don't know how she knew, but she knew. She was She've ready. come for me, after all. <laughs> Had a feeling. Yo, this is the icon demo. All clear. So, I didn't show you guys this, but in the icon challenge for the demo, you play as Clive in this part right here. But you have like three, three icons at your disposal. Meaning you have not just the Phoenix, but you also have Garuda and Titan. And here, that's a nice trick. You'll have to teach me sometime. Literally, like, just like this. We should start with the dungeons. They may be holding the bearers there. Sound plan. As long as we keep ourselves on this side of the bars. In here. They're all empty. And you're gonna give up. Sid, this gate. Come on now. Need some help. What do you think? That I'm doing most of the lifting. <laughs> Did you hear that? Unfortunately, yes. Great the army may already be in the chair. Find him. About a window. How about a window? <laughs> yeah, I play, I'm sorry, I played this early. Yeah. I know what happens. Yeah. Bloody show off. Well, we found the Imperial Garrison. Right where the royalists left. <sighs> I was, I'm gonna assume the top place I couldn't go through. It's 
This looks like one of these. Um, increase Scarlet Cyclone damage by seven, but also decreases that. Like my badge. Oh. Sound the All this bloody running. After them! Oh, well guarded. Um, second opponent from the front while guarding the no damage circle around to them. Or use the ability. We have them! Seems they were expecting them. You don't say. <laughs>
through the chapel. Then Greg Riga must have plans for us. the last part right here what the hell happened here a little light for prayer isn't it do I seem so desperate as to grovel at the feet of a false god <laughs> I was waiting for you not for too long I hope all this for a midnight chat. Well, let's chat then. Where are the men and women you took from Lost Wing? You mean where's the dominant? Well, Lude shall be requiring his services indefinitely. Come back to me, Sidolphus. I need you. Think of all the things we can create together. The world that we can build. You need me. <laughs> Your king needs me. I'm all for building a new world. Just not his. That bastard's dreams are as twisted as his promises are false. And I want no part of him. King Dang Barnabas it. saved you, and this is how you speak of him. Have you no shred of loyalty? What? To a leader who'd use me? Like he uses you. You know nothing of me, Sidolphus. You're right. I don't know who you are anymore, or what you want. I only know what you used to say, that you were tired of running, that you just wanted to be free, free of it all. You weren't lying to me then, so what changed? What made you think you had to sacrifice who you were to get what you wanted? Sacrifice. I use my talents to my advantage, and you would tell me there is shame in that? If there's no shame, then why do you feel so sorry for yourself? A rousing speech, Lord Commander. I was a fool to believe you might have changed. The only person I feel sorry for is you! I can't do this anymore. If you would stand between our leash and his dream, then you leave me no choice. Goodbye, Sidolphus. Bro. Stand back, Clyde. Finish them. Already took one down. Well, sir. Oh, you think I can take down the other? My face is not free against one.
Are you all right? Do I look all right? <laughs> Benedicta will be on her way to collect the dominant if she hasn't already. You can't afford to let them leave. Remember, she has wings, you don't. What about you? Before or after I catch my breath. <laughs> Sorry. Come on, Toggle. Man, he's all beat up. Alright y'all, that's going to conclude this episode here. Hope you guys all enjoyed it as much as I did. As always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Out. Peace.